Hi everyone, with Kelvin here. So we just finished weekly contest 150. Let's discuss about the second question. Maximum level sum of a binary tree. So given the root of a binary tree, um, the level of the root is start from 1 and the next level will be 2 and so on. So we're being asked to return um, um, the level which have maximum sum and if we have multiple sum multiple multiple level that having the same sum then we return the smallest level we first met so yeah how are we going to solve this problem so as you can see the example here um, first level the sum is one second level the sum is seven plus zero two and third level the sum is seven plus minus eight which is minus one right so the maximum sum is on the level two which is seven so how are we going to solve this problem? This problem can be solved by BFS. So we iterate the first level and then add every node of the second level. And then we calculate the second level. And while we are calculating, add every add all child of the second level and we will have the third level. So yeah, um, the BFS code is very straightforward. So I create a queue by link list um, using a tree node. And then I add the root for our, my, our initial um, state and then I mark the level as zero um, which at the end I will do an increment so it depends on where you want to put the increment but I put it at the first so I start with zero and then maximum level is the level that having maximum sum and then maximum level sum is the maximum sum of that level the output we want um, is the level and the sum is the track line uh, is there any level that is bigger than the current maximum level so yeah first we increase the level and then we have sum of zero right and then we check how many number of um, node we have in the queue means this is the number we have on that level like second level we have two so um, when we start the queue should have two right so we iterate through all of the node in that level and then we pop it out from the queue right so I add the sum of each of the node on the second level and when they have a child we should add it to the queue again right if they have left child put it to the, uh, the queue right child pull it to the queue but mm, so why we store a current level size here so this for loop we already know like how many item we have on current level because when we add the new new nodes in it's supposed to be on the next level so yeah that's why we only have this uh, um, the as the number we originally store and then we pull it out but we keep adding in that's why this is a four and then after that we check so after this iteration it means um, all the node on that level is already being iterated so we know the sum right so we just check the sum is larger than the max level sum then yeah uh, if the sum is larger then we replace the max level with um, the current level we iterate and the max level sum we replace it with the current sum we got and then after that we after we finish through all of it means um, of course the node is empty then we return the max level so yeah that's it for this question thank you for watching see you on the next weekly contest